All right, hello YouTube, and welcome back to my low rank through mass rank with Gunlance playthrough. We are making our way towards being able to make the final armor set that I want to use for high rank, which just kind of happens to be full basil. You know, not that surprising, honestly. But we still need to hunt Magnamalo and Almadron. Uh, I'm waiting to hunt any Elder Dragons until I get this armor set, just because defense is really low right now compared to this. So this stuff's not being touched. I usually don't like starting off with really tough stuff, so we're going to go through this, you know, maybe hunt one or two things before we go into Almadron and Magnamalo. Like... You know, I can make that, but like, Protective Polish could be one because we want to hunt, uh, hunt Magnamalo anyway. So if we hunt Great Azuchi, we just have to hunt Nargakuga after we hunt all we need. Seems like a decent start to me. So we can just go hunt Great Azuchi now. And I should go okay-ish. I'd hope. So, let's go ahead. Great Azuchi. I haven't hunted Great Azuchi in high rank, right? Um, yeah. I did not. Cool. Just making sure. Because <laughs> sometimes I, uh... I'll just kind of forget. Alright. But before I get into this first hunt... If you watch this on YouTube and you end up enjoying, think about liking and subscribing. And if you want to hang out live whenever I do these, I do these every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 7.30 Eastern over on Twitch at twitch.tv slash techman. Link is also in the description, so come on by, hang out, hopefully have a good time. Let's get into it. Great Zuchi, so should be a nice little warm up. Granted, I've kind of already warmed up because this is right after the last one. But all right. So over there. Oh god. Did I re-equip my... Okay, I just making sure I did actually re-equip the, uh... My... Because last part I did a little bit of... Ore farming. I did one run of ore farming. And, you know, wanted to make sure that I actually had my... N normal set on. Because not exactly a good time when you don't even have your actual set on. The little ones messed it up. Doesn't even matter though. God, that is a hundred damage already. We're breaking the hundred damage mark on for reliable hits. Which is kind of surprising, honestly. That was dumb. Thanks, buddy. Oh. How about no? None of that. Incoming! 
right? Oh boy. This is always annoying to do. Um, honestly, I want Arzuros as a Wyvern ride. Rogi's not that great. I have to get one. Ideally, I can get both, but I don't think I can. Uh, of course. All right. Boom, boom. Actually landed the full combo this time. A lot of times you don't. That's annoying. Nice. Boom. Boom. Ah, uh, little whiff. Should have aimed more towards him. Thank you. Nice. Boom. Too early. Um. You good? You seem confused. He does already have blue skull though, so. for it. Probably shouldn't. Eh, it worked out good enough. And there goes Reizuchi. Alright, cool. Grezuchi is pretty low time, so. That means I'm at least, you know, doing decent with the weapon, I feel like. Alright. Not a bad start. I think we'll jump ahead, though, to, uh. Probably Almadron first, then Magnamalo, and then we'll drop back down. Hoping I can get a uh, charm that has some guard on it. Bye now. Huh. And welcome to my 
That's a decent charm for right now. I mean, not right now, right now, but at this point in the game. I don't know if there's actually any three slots that I would want. Actually, I think offensive guard is three. Yeah. So. Granted, I don't really care that much about offensive guard, but it's nice to have. It's kind of a win more option. Alright. Alma drawn. I should be able to... If if uh, low rank is any indication, I should be able to block most of his stuff and then counter relatively simply. I just have to not play like an idiot. What a concept. Now, am I going to do that? Um, probably not. I'll probably be an idiot and then I cart once and then I... You know, stop. At least try to stop. I'm back. All right, that chipped a little bit. Almatron kind of counters what I do. Like it just makes an area that is annoying to get out of that just damages you. That was super delayed on the game. I pressed that a while ago. Probably should have waited. And by probably, I mean I definitely should have. I can't block that, or at least I need guard up. Not sure which. some good damage. You you just whiffed, my dude. I was standing still. Alright, that might break it. Yep, nice. Boom. Worm stake in the head. Okay, well, I kind of missed the hit zone a little bit, but... It's fine. Alright. Good first encounter. Broke the mud ball. So that's pretty good. Alright. 
Okay. Okay. I mean, each full burst is 140 damage. So... Like... Assuming I get all 20s. Which is kind of weird that it's not all the same. Because I'm pretty sure shells don't crit. And I don't think it's tied to attack either. In the back. Really, Ludroths? What? Like, why are there three Ludroths just like walking across here, like casually? Like, that was kind of random. Okay. Okay, that did hurt uh, quite a bit. I'm blocking just in case. Oh, of course I did it too early. Because you hold that for like 10 years. I figured it was worth a shot. Although that might have just hit behind me. <laughs> Probably should have just tried backing up. Especially since I kind of have a Vade extender. But, eh. It's whatever. And other than when he has the ball of mud, I feel like I'm relatively... I mean, not safe, but like... If I die, it's like... Gonna be from a series of things, not one singular thing. Granted, did have some health missing, so... Alright, Wyvern Fire away, booyah, and a boom boom, wow, okay, another roar, sure. Right. Hold on. Thanks, buddy. Okay, sure. Don't know really how I ended up over here, but I'll take it.
don't. Nice. Okay, that was cheap. Yeah, I'm taking this opportunity to heal. So I don't feel like getting down my last cart and being stressed. Because that's usually how that goes. Last cart is always stressful. Especially when you have like under par gear. And so things do just insane damage when you get hit. Okay. Your days are numbered. Yeah, I still got a full burst and hail cutter. Uh, I didn't even get hit, but I got knocked away. How was that? Fucking cheating. All right, away he goes, I guess. And this is why I really can't wait to get protective polish. It's because, like, it's doing it before I start a fight that's that max a minute and a half of no sharpness lost. So I just don't need to care. Plus one slots are not that fought over in this game compared to world. So it's like I'll just have speed sharpening. God, I hate you so much. You are just annoying. Okay, I definitely had my weapon out. Or at least I was trying to. God damn. It's fine, just don't care about me pulling my weapon out, I guess. Really? Thanks, buddy. And I'm like a mile away now. Boom, boom. Nice. I was expecting the backflip thing for some reason, even though that's not even how that starts up. Really? Why? Since when is that of a, that of a hitbox? 
And why should I even think that that has a hitbox? I'm not convinced I've ever seen that move. Huh. He, like, made a whirlpool? I'm, I'm not convinced I've ever seen that move. Um, okay then. Um, you weren't in the water to do that, I call bullshit. I'm hoping he doesn't go on and okay, he's leaving anyway. Although I might be able to get some before he leaves. I'll get a wake up hit. A plate. <laughs> Nothing I need it. Oh. He is asleep now. Let's get a hail cutter off just to get that timer down. Er. Get ready. Wakey wakey. That might be my first kill on Wake Up with Wyvern Fire. I know I haven't gotten many, if it isn't. Alright. So now we need to hunt Magnum all, though. <laughs> Jeez. Alright. Almadron? Yeah, we hunt Magnum Malo, and then we can go lower tier stuff. To that point, it'll just be I need to hunt what I need for decorations. And then just finishing high rank. To be fair, there are a couple decorations that I want that need Narwa stuff, so. You know, we'll have to go back up in difficulty a bit at some point. But, you know, that that's for then. So, what do they have is this. So you hunt Magnamalo, the Nargakuga. That might end up being like the rest of the part. So, Magnamalo, we're gonna be up here. 
In low rank, I was able to block most. Actually, I think I was able to block everything. Just, I think some stuff did. Of course, this is the one where I don't get bombardier. So I'm just gonna be doing less damage, but. Um. Yeah. Oh well, that's how it goes sometimes. Although I should probably check if that uh, stacks or not with artillery, because if it doesn't, then I don't even need to worry about it eventually. Yeah, no, tail doesn't stick around long enough for that. But it is a free, uh... Free sharpness boost. Yeah. Okay, that does a little bit of chip, but nothing too extreme, thankfully. Okay, the game just didn't register my counter. That's cool. It's like, nope, not doing it. Yep, yeah, just free sharpness. In. All right, you are leaving, so I mean, first encounter, not not too bad. And I think I'm not gonna even, like, bother trying to, uh, like, attack-wise counter the, uh, like, little blast from his tail. I'll just kind of use it to gain sharpness. Heal up a bit though. Evade extender too, baby. I don't know if that's sticking around. I didn't have a good view. That usually, if I'm able to, I can usually stay close enough. Okay. Boom. Oh, this one I can counter, I think. Yeah, cool. I actually managed to counter one. Why? Alright. Let's get that off of me.
Fair enough. Nice, down he goes. Boom, boom. Warm stake. One more full burst. is leaving so I can just get a free full burst right there yeah I think this is going pretty well but honestly like Magnum Molo is not too bad with gun lance you can block most of his stuff I honestly didn't expect to be able to do. Okay, fair enough. Nope. Boom, boom. Worm steak. Thanks for the sharpness. Sharpness, cool. Nope. Only one, all right. That's usually free. Sharpness. My palico, sure, I'll take it. That was risky. Okay, I expect that to come from me. Yeah, that does do a bunch of chip. I mean, rightfully so, though. Like, that's definitely a move that you should just, like, Superman dive. for it. Cool. I wasn't 100% sure. Nope. I feel like that, that one would have even more, like, weight behind it. Just because it's like, he's 
falling out of the air, basically. He's not really using the momentum. Alright. I'd say this is going pretty well. To make sure though that if I'm gonna try to block that the big hit attack, which I think I'm probably not gonna try to, honestly. Nope. Only one? Alright. Boom, boom. Free sharpness. I mean, it's not free free, but it might as well be free. Down he goes, alright. Boom. I'll take the miss. Yeah, fair enough. Not going for it. Only one? I expected multiple. There we go. Nope. Yeah, that was on me. Uh, okay. Seal up. Okay, left anyway, so good. Alright. Yeah, I get hit more than I should have there. So. That's on me 100%. That stuff I really shouldn't be getting hit by at this point. Eh. I'll end it. <laughs> and a boom, boom. I'm just going to be back here. Okay. Let's heal up. Let's not be dumb. We gain some knockback during this mode, I guess, then, huh?
Knock him out of it. Sharpness. Okay, whiffed. Yeah, I'm not... There's no point in trying to mess with it. I don't really... I gain literally nothing from it. Yeah. Like, that's basically that, but... A little bit lesser. Didn't want a Superman dive. Okay. Okay, yeah, see, I have a problem with that. Where it's just inconsistent what I can block. That, like, you need to be consistent on can I block the, the explosions or not? Because right there I was told no, but every other time it's been yes. Unless it was behind me? Which then it's like, well... That's kind of more annoying, because, okay, the area is not as, uh, you know, defined. Because it explodes bigger than, like, the actual gas cloud. All right, Almadron. Cool. Ooh, nice. We get Blue Skull to do this as well. Eh. I'd rather just do that a bunch. I know it's like technically less damage, but maybe I'll do it to finish here. Yeah. Yeah, because that's like a little more damage, but it's not like insanely more. Right, you don't actually have a final big attack. That's why I always think like your thing kind of sucks. Okay. Okay. And there he goes. So do I... I guess I never really noticed. Do I just not take damage from moves that I block with that? Because that adds a whole other level of usefulness to it. And also, does it inherit, inherit my, like, guard up if I have it? Or does it already have it, or what? That's definitely something I need to look up. Alright. So I think we hunt Nargakuga to finish this off, then. That seems like a good idea. Because that'll let me get protective polish decorations, which is definitely by far my most, like, my favorite utility skill to have with gun lance. Just because, well, normal shelling gun lance, I should say. Just because full burst eats a lot of sharpness, so protective polish is, like, one of the best things for it, in my opinion. Just because... 
Full burst eats no sharpness then. If you need an indication of how many potions I use, it's not many. I basically only use the ones that they give you. Alright, so... Alright, we go to... Alright, it's this. We hunt in Magnamalo. We hunt Nargakuga. And we can get Protect Abolish decorations. I'm, I'm gonna just double check, though. Like, so Basil... We hunt on Almadron, we can get this. On Magnamalo, we can get this. I have one. We hunt on Aknasom, right? I'm pretty sure we hunt on Aknasom. Oh right, never mind. I remember realizing that uh, Basirio, so you can get Inferno Sacks from, so. Okay. And then we're not hunting Elder Dragons until we get this Basil set, which this is all. Yeah. So that's good. What else could we make? Okay, so it looks like that's probably the only thing we'll be able to make. Unless I want to make my third Wirebug Jewel. I mean, we can make these two. I already made one, though. So, that was known. Alright, so yeah. Nargakuga. Nargakuga probably here. Yeah. So, I mean, we are going down in difficulty, but our armor still isn't up to par, so it's not going to feel like it. Granted, it helps I do know Nargakuga's moveset a bit. Just a little bit. Kind of, you know, my favorite monster and all. The only thing I don't know how to really, like, work around is the Tail Slam in uh, Master Rank. Just because how you have to dodge it just... Anything that's not, you know, like... A simple thing to dodge, it just doesn't compute in my head. Oh, I thought my thing was back. It was not. Okay, cool. Love it when that happens. Literally the easiest Wyvern fire of all time. Yeah. 
Okay. Yeah, I figure I should do a hail cutter just to get the wyvern fire cooldown going down a little bit. Okay, three times. I was expecting you to do your little side dodge. That's a rain kind of messed me up there a little bit. I was hoping I could get another hail cutter there, but hit the ground before I could. It, it, it is what it is. But so far, so good. I'll be honest, I rarely ever see you do th three into the spins. It's usually two and then side hop into like the big thing. Which is weird. Toby Kadachi here, which very good wyvern ride. Hell yeah. Let's do this. Nope. And a one. Okay, so that confirms the question I had, is can shells KO with Thunderblade? They can, in fact, KO with Thunderblade. The more you know. Alright. Sharpen up. I'm gonna grab the materials first. I got time. Boom. Alright. That works. Oh, okay. Okay, so it's not quite 50% that you get from it, but it's pretty damn close to 50% of the cooldown.
Okay. Really just stop doing tail slams of any kind. Here we go. There's one. Hmm. I can go for a wyvern fire. Probably shouldn't have. Hey, at least I'm not using a range weapon. That would have killed me. Ask me how I know. Oof. No, 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 no. Why? Why would you do that, Toby? You're not even supposed to be here. I already, I already got a wyvern red. Damn it. Ah, that's gonna hurt a little bit. Yeah. And there's that. Probably could have gotten a wyvern fire if I wanted to. They'll knock me out of the way. Feels bad. And there he goes. That's what it looks like when you know a monster's moveset. Alright, so I should be able to then. Well, I can. Not should. I can uh, get protective polish decorations now, which will be really nice. Means I can get up to 90 seconds of just no sharpness loss every time I sharpen. Which, uh, I don't know if you've seen, but I do it pretty often. So, cutting that down at all will be nice. You know, well, was it Almadron that I literally went to, I, I had to sharpen to gel? It was with this gun lance, I'm pretty sure. It's like it had a decent amount of blue. I went through blue, green, and yellow. <laughs> Actually, and orange. I went to the freaking red sharpness. You should try to never get to, but... When you just full burst over and over, kind of hard. Ooh, nice platinum egg. It's nice 100k. Eh. Not great charms, but... 
is what it is. But all right, that is going to do it for this one. So if you watch us on YouTube, hope you enjoyed. Like, subscribe, all that fun stuff, and I will see you next time. See ya.